Hey guys, this is a quick message to you all, uh, especially my new viewers that don't know me that well. Um, to Seeker of Light, you sent a question into the Church of the Eternally Secure, and I want to say thank you for trusting in us and your faith in us as your brethren to answer you the best we can. Um, I really appreciate that. And what I need to remember is I'm not always answering a question. Uh, and I heard Rabbi Zacharias say it very well. He said, you're, you're ans answering a questioner. So I always have to remember uh, that there is a set of beliefs and there is a person behind the question. So I want to tell you now, if I ever come across with zeal or frustrated or even angry, Please understand, it's never at you. It frustrates me because, and it's not because you asked the question. Praise God you asked the question. I'm glad you asked the question. It's never, please don't ever think that. I want you to ask questions. I want everybody to. And I will ask God to help me answer them the best I can. And if I can't answer it, I'll tell you, hey, I'm not qualified. I'm not great at eschatology. Maybe you should go to such and such who's better at it. Soteriology is my specialty, which is the salvation message of the Bible. Um, but I want you to know I'm never angry at you. And forgive me if I ever have hurt any of you or made you feel uh, that I was frustrated with you. I spend my days edifying my family in Christ. I love the good news. And Paul tells us to think on things that are good, that which is true, that which edifies, to not get wrapped up in anything that causes fear, to always remind people who they are in Christ, what Jesus has done for them, the love that God has for them, the love that was demonstrated through giving his only son for us. So it really frustrates me and does anger me that so many false teachers. Now, there are some that have big channels and TV shows and they have uh, doctorates in theology. I don't care. That is no substitute for truth. And then there's others on YouTube that should not be teaching anything. Be not many masters. They're, they are just destroying verses out of context. They are confusing people and I know in my gut God didn't call them to preach or teach I, I know it why because they have a false gospel for one a bad tree can't produce good fruit so I'm frustrated that they come and try to sow fear in you doubt in you take away your blessed assurance your peace your joy and other fruits of the spirit so I get angry at them for doing that but forgive me if I've ever made any uh any questioner feel that I was angry at them, please forgive me for that if I have. Okay? God bless you guys. I love you all.